hello beautiful people welcome back to my channel in today's video I'm gonna be sharing with you all what I wore this week if you're new to my channel welcome my name is Carla and on this channel I share videos on fashion beauty and lifestyle if you enjoy these kinds of videos then please subscribe down below so like I just mentioned this video is what I wore this week usually when I film this video I have my phone in my hand because I have images of what I wore this week because if not I will forget um, so let's start off with my first outfit sometimes I try to theme out my outfits for the week like do I want to wear a dress this week do I want to wear denim this week do I want to wear a sweater this week things like that it just makes it easier to pick out outfits um, I know some people pick out outfits for the entire week but I feel like sometimes if you have a theme it's easier to go with that theme when you're picking out outfits so I'm editing this video and I realized that my highlight is highlight um, so bear with me I'm fully aware um, yes just bear with me so my theme for this week was dresses um, the first outfit is just a regular black dress and I just wanted to kind of use the items in my closet and incorporate it into a winter outfit so what I did was I took my just fab brown boots these are sold out but if I can find any ones that are similar to them I will have them linked down below I just took my brown tan boots from just fab and then I threw a blazer over my dress this is a long sleeve ruffle dress I got this from boohoo if I'm not mistaken um, like I said it's long sleeve so I just threw my blazer over it it wasn't too cold so it's easier to do this but if I needed to throw like a wool coat or anything over I could and if I needed to put it on I would as well and then as far as a purse goes I have my coach purse this one was from the coach outlet so I probably wouldn't be able to find it for you on the coach outlet if I can find it on Amazon or something similar I will link it because sometimes Amazon does have these bags um, whether they're just overstock and people have purchased them and now they're reselling them or whatever the case may be Amazon does sell like coach Terry Tory Burch um, those kind of brands um, so yes that was the outfit and for accessories um, a couple of like my earrings were from my boutique CS fashion boutique at shop Carla um, my necklace was from my boutique as well and I think that was pretty much it um, but if you don't have any accessories like if you don't want to go out and buy accessories just grab any gold accessories that you have I just I went with gold because the hardware on the handbag is gold and then the shoes were tan so I just wanted to bring all those colors together okay so the next outfit is again a dress um, well it's actually a shirt dress I've used it as a like a shirt or jacket if you may um, over like leggings and a top but for today I did decide to wear it as a dress so this is also for my boutique um, I'll have all of these things linked down below I use the same um, boots that I shared from just fab and then my handbag was my red Telfar handbag and why I went with red is I just wanted something I wanted an almost colorful yet kind of neutral outfit like you will stand out in this outfit but it almost feels neutral because you get the greens you get the browns um, but I wanted to pull the red one because my lip my lippy was red um, and then there is some red on the shirt and I just yeah like I said I just wanted to pull the reds and then for accessories I just wore gold accessories um, my watch was from Michael Kors same exact earrings from my previous outfit um, this was just something that was very quick and easy to put together um, effortless this was definitely an effortless outfit if you wanted to pair tights with this you can definitely change this up if you wanted to like if you had let's say you have black boots um, you could take some black tights some black leggings um, and put on some black boots over it maybe like a black coat just to 
tone down on the colors a little bit a black handbag if you're afraid of color that's a way to do it say you like this shirt dress but you're just like Carla this is too much color for me then just leave the shirt dress for what it is and pair some neutrals with it right so do an all black with it um, just to tone it down a little bit the next outfit I definitely grabbed a dress but then I was like okay I really don't feel like wearing a dress it's kind of cold what can I do to this dress to kind of change it up a little bit so I took this a turtleneck that I got from Primark um, and then I just took a regular basic belt I put it over it so it almost even though it's a dress it appears like I have on a top and a skirt but as you saw it is a dress um, as far as boots go I use my favorite misguided boots guys I am so sad about these boots because that little bottom piece on the boots has it's broken off so I do need to get it fixed I'm still wearing them but I still do need to get them fixed it's just it's a sad moment for me with these boots and I tried to reorder them and misguided sent me the wrong boots like it was just a whole entire sad moment so yes these are the boots that I paired um, the reason why I went with black was because the belt was black so when I think of outfits if I'm thinking about matching more sometimes you don't have to match if you're mix mixing prints you don't always have to be like matchy matchy um, but if I want to I just think of okay what piece can I pull from this to kind of just bring the entire outfit together so that is why I wore the black boots it's because the belt is black and then the silver hardware because my dress or skirt um, in this case my dress and my shirt is gray so I was like okay let me just use the silver hardware with a pop of color with my red Shane Justin bag of course with the silver hardware so with this outfit I wanted more grays and silvers um, when it came to hardware and color and of course you get the red for the pop of color if you're afraid of color again just grab a black bag just to bring all the blacks together gray and black nothing wrong with that I just did this because I wanted a pop of color obviously my lip is the pop of color um, and to bring that up my bag red and red um, so that is why I did that the next outfit um, I wanted something neutral again with a pop of color um, so I just went with black like I did with my gray outfit I used my black Zara dress I don't think I mentioned this but my gray slip dress was from Zara if I can find something similar from Zara I will have it linked down below if I just find any gray slip dress I will also link that down below because Zara is tricky I can show you something and in a split second it's all gone so if I can find something similar I will have it linked down below um, so yes this black dress is from Zara and then I took this turtleneck from Marshalls um, if you don't know I found this out recently but you can shop on Marshalls as well as at TJ Maxx and you can get luxury pieces from TJ Maxx like I've seen a Loewe purse on TJ Maxx I was unable to get it because it was sold out um, but I did see a Loewe purse they have luxury designer items on the TJ Maxx website just an FYI just so you know um, so yes this turtleneck oversized sweater is from Marshalls um, and then all I did here was I took my belt it's actually tucked like my sweater is tucked into the belt just to kind of give that shirt and skirt vibe as far as handbag I knew I wanted to wear my Nicole Lionel bag um, the pink one I knew I wanted actually I've been saying her name wrong it's Nicole Lanel. I need to get that in my head because it's almost like impulsive to say Nicole Lanel, but it's Nicole Lanel. Um, so I knew I wanted to wear her handbag. Um, and then I was like, oh, what do I do for boots, right? Because I have pink heels that match this bag to a T. And I knew I had these boots that the pinks are off and you will be able to see it I went with the boots because I wanted to be one comfortable and I wanted to be warm so I went with the boots instead again the pinks are off but 
I was like, whatever. It is what it is. Um, I like my outfit. I was comfortable. And that's what really matters in anything that you wear. As long as you're comfortable, that is all that matters. Um, there will be outfits that you wear that people will not understand. And that is okay. There will be outfits that people love. And that's when you're just like, yay. But I almost want you guys to be happy regardless of how people feel about your outfit. Of course, we want that that yeah I really like your outfit but if you don't get it as long as you're comfortable and you feel good with what you're wearing that is all that matters that is all that matters once you can please you once you can make you happy that is it that is it literally watch out world because once a person can do that for themselves that's it that is it yes. let's move on to my final outfit for the week this outfit i wasn't too sure like too sure about i knew i wanted to pair like brown with yellow but and i knew i wanted to wear this dress so i almost like threw this together i felt good but i just i wasn't really like yes 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 and i realized exactly why that was that like why i felt that way so i'm going to share with you guys why in case you want to just change this outfit up a little bit so the dress is from zara um i shared this a long time ago i love brown i love this dress it's knit it like sucks me in love it love it love it love it took the boots again um that i shared with my first two outfits um just because they're comfortable, they're heels, they're knee high, so I can pair dresses, skirts, all that stuff with it. Um, and then the blazer. This is where I went wrong. So this blazer is thrifted. Um, if you have a thrift store near you, go check them out because you can find good things at a thrift store. So where I went wrong in this outfit and what threw me off um, is that I rolled the sleeves up. I think this outfit would have been perfectly fine without the sleeves rolled up and i noticed that after because i was like why do i feel off like why do i feel off and it's because i rolled my sleeves so in this outfit do not roll your roll your sleeves if you're wearing a dad blazer an oversized blazer do not roll your sleeves um and then as far as the handbag goes i wore my coach cassie in the yellow again i wanted the brown and the yellow so i paired my coach cassie i did learn that unfortunately coach has stopped making the coach cassie it's like that was sad because i'm like this is a great bag i've said this to you all multiple times um it's a great dupe for the Louis Vuitton Pochette Matisse. It's a great dupe. Like the look of it, the accordion style, the top handle, it comes with the strap so that you can wear it crossbody. It's just so sad that Coach has, has stopped making it. I think I saw one on the Coach outlet. So if you're looking for this handbag, if you're looking for a dupe for the Pochette Matisse, then you can definitely keep looking on the Coach outlet site. It is like coach is just more affordable yes you can find um other brands that sell something similar to the pochette matisse i've seen one from gucci but again it, you're getting the same about price for like it's gonna they're gonna be about in the same price point and the one i saw from gucci is actually leather so it may be a little more expensive than the pochette matisse because remember the pochette matisse is canvas um when you have leather it's going to be a little more pricey so that's why i just felt like the coach cassie was perfect so coach if you can bring that bag back for people that are looking for dupes for the pochette matisse that would be great um but yes those were all of my outfits like i mentioned if i can find anything similar i will definitely have them linked in my description box down below um i hope this video i had someone tell me that um this video kind of encourages and it, it does and i hope that that's what it does i want to be like encourage you to use things in your wardrobe and if you don't if there's one piece you see in any of the items that i share a staple piece something that you just feel that you will use over and over again then feel free to buy it um 
I love that a lot of the things in my wardrobe are interchangeable. Do I shop and buy more things? Yes. You all are fully aware of that. If you look through my channel, you'll see a lot of haul videos because I do buy lots of things. But I also wear the things that I buy for the most part. There are some things in my wardrobe that still needs um, to one be used or needs more use. But for the most part, I do get to use and put a lot of the things in my wardrobe to use. Um, but yeah, that's it for this video. Remember to be kind to yourself and be kind to others. Love yourself and love others as well. Also remember to follow me on TikTok and Instagram at Carla.Simon19. See you in the next video.